What's up? What's up? What's up, everybody? So, I got good news. Um, I'm excited because, well, I'm going to step outside. Um, I finally got confirmation that I will be blogging, or one of the bloggers, one of the influencers at the Sneaker Ball, which is like a really big thing because, well, um... You know, there's a lot going on in, uh, in Greensboro, and I'm sure there's a lot going on in your town, too. And so we got the Feature Highlight Awards, which I had the pleasure of going twice, and then COVID happened, so I'm kind of out of touch with that. So I got to find out about that because I would love to blog there as well. So I got the Feature Highlight Awards, and then um, so I'll reach out to them to see whether or not I could do that. But I'm excited because, well, <laughs> um, I got confirmation that I will be one of the bloggers at the Sneaker Ball, which is amazing. But, you know, I tried to get this particular sneaker that has like a shoe because I still haven't lost weight. And the sneakers kind of make you look, you know, kind of big and, well, me, kind of big and dumpy. So I got these sneakers. They're not the sneakers that I wanted, but it does go with my outfit, and I'm excited about that. And then my husband, we got to take him out shopping and everything. So, there's some good things that are going on and everything. So, I decided to come outside and talk to you guys. <sighs> so, you know, guys, I was looking at this... Um, I guess it's a YouTube, and so my husband, like, when he gets up in the morning, he looks at all of these YouTube things, whether it's camera work or whatever. So I'm looking at this YouTube, and <laughs> and it, it was talking about everybody has 24 hours a day. And what you do with it is what, you know, what's good for you, or, you know. Or, you know what I mean. You guys know what I mean. You know, leave your comments. <laughs> Let me know. You know what I mean. You know. But anyway, everybody has 24 hours um, to do the things that they do. What you choose to do, it is up to you. So, there's no different than Oprah Winfrey with her 24 hours than with, say, me with my 24 hours. Or you with your 24 hours. And, you know, I would preach that all the time. But the problem that I think that I was having personally is that I wasn't believing what I was saying and this video you know I'm gonna look it up because I you know how you wake up and you just listen to it but I don't know the guy's name or anything so the next blog I'll definitely go ahead and update you with the name so you guys can listen to it too and let me know what you think about it but anyway is 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 your way of thinking if you don't believe that you're going to, let's say, have a good day. You're not going to have a good day. Guys, forgive, forgive me. I, I need to get one of those stands that you hold while you're blogging and stuff like that. Yeah. So anyway, if you don't believe that you're going to have a good day, then guess what? You're not going to have a good day. You're, you're not going to in joy your day that's why i decided to come out and do this blog outside in my yard today because you know i woke up and the first thing i did i had this feeling in my stomach and i'm like oh my god this you know this that and the other my life this that and the other and you know i need to think about the positive things that are going on in my life and that, a lot of times we tend not to do that and so if you don't believe that you can be what you want to do in life, then you're not going to do it. If you're just if you're just going by the daily, but you know, just living emotions, but you're not believing in yourself, you're not going to be able to do it. And this morning, I was not believing in myself. I was like, oh my god, you know, um, last year the you know the sound that we did didn't come out so well, and you know they're not going to want us to come back again and and everything and lo and behold they did now they didn't mention about the sound the sound wasn't good but you know what we were learning how to do it our sound is going to be better this year and guess what next year will be even better and so i believe that we're going to bring a better a better quality of um excuse me a better quality of 
footage to these people plus i'm gonna blog about it and of course i'll go my daily blog and i'll come on here and you know and i'm gonna go behind the scenes you know how i do i'm gonna do all of that stuff so <sighs> So anyway, I'm going to go in here with my son and we're going to talk with him a little bit and then I'm going to let you guys enjoy your day. <laughs> yeah. Now I'm sitting inside with my son and we had a meeting earlier because one of the things that I'm trying to do better, I'm trying to get my life to where I can be a little bit more organized. And um, by the way, um, a little bit later or down below, I'm have a link who did my hair she's uh, my son actually introduced her to her to, uh, to her to her he was getting his hair done first and it looks so good and her name is Maya and so she did my hair and um I just wanted to go ahead and shout out to her she did a beautiful job in my hair and I feel fabulous darling but anyway <laughs> I'm on here and so my son is getting ready to watch TV but one of the things that we were talking about was um, getting a fashion show together. So you know that I got to really organize my day to really get it together to be able to do this fashion show. So we're trying to collaborate with a couple of people and we have a meeting and I'll bring you along with my daily blog with that as well. To at least let you know how the meeting went. And um, we're going to have a meeting with Hananiah and she is, oh my God, she's doing some really great things. And so you know, I'm really nervous because I really want this to this collaboration to really go off. So it's my son and Hananiah and I get to organize a fashion show. So that's really exciting. So, um, no, AJ, could you, can you tell him a little bit about it? Can I put this on you? Sure. Okay. I have to ask because, you know. <laughs> okay, go ahead. He's, he's always working. <laughs> um. Yeah, so it's a clothing line that I came up with, uh, aliencustomapparel.com. Check it out. Um, I'm working on designs right now as we speak. Uh, yeah, we're just we're trying to get that going, trying to get that popping. New adventure, new tasks in our lives. Like my mom, I'm trying to get organized as well because I want to be a millionaire. <laughs> a way to do that than a billionaire, a trillionaire, and there's something after a trillionaire. What is it? What's it called? Quadrillionaire. Quadrillionaire. That have all that type of money, but I'm, I'm just trying to have enough money where I can just take a vacation. What did they say? Two point five times a year. Something like that. So, you know that's right. <laughs> so I'm just trying to, you know, Kevin Hart says with my bank account set up, I'm trying to get that right. But also, too, I also want to create and put things out in the world. It's not all about money, but, you know, you need money to survive in this world. But I would like to also create, and I love creating. I went to school for art, did graphic design for many, many years. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's where we had a meeting earlier. So I'm trying to organize. So, guys, I did get up. At 8 o'clock this morning. I'm so freaking proud of myself. And you know what I did? Because normally when I wake up, I'm like, oh, it's 8 o'clock and I'll lay there and I'll hit the snooze button. I know people love that snooze button. But if you can avoid the snooze button, avoid the snooze button. Because all it does is trick your mind into thinking you got another couple of hours to sleep when you don't. You just got a couple of minutes. So when you, if anything, your snooze is sit up straight. You know, I sat up straight in the bed. You know, I, um, you know, I, I did an even tone breathing, you know, because I suck, as you guys know, I suffer from anxiety. And sometimes lately I be waking up and I already anxiety has hit me because of everything that's going on in my life. And so just like a, I did like an even breathing. Some people like to get up and get coffee. That's what I did. I got, I got up and got my coffee. I drank it. I even took my mother-in-law to her field service today, you know, so that's been a challenge for me too, because, you know, she's she's not able to drive anymore and so now we got to take every place that she goes and sometimes it doesn't you know you, you know when you, when you're doing things it doesn't kind of combine what you're doing and stuff like that so that's Gigi you guys saw her yesterday <laughs> Gigi um for me stands for gangster granny <laughs> but Gigi 
is just great grandmother and she's 86 years old and you know she suffers from a little bit of dementia but she's the most wittiest woman I have ever met in my life so don't let that fool you okay because she's she's you know but anyway there's challenges with that too so anyway I'm going to sit here and watch some tv with my son I want you guys to enjoy your day um, value your 24 hours a day, make it work for you, whether it's just today you decide to catch up on some sleep, that's your 24 hours. Today you decided that you're going to uh, write a book or you're going to take a walk or exercise, get healthy, whatever it is, value your 24 hours. So anyway, today's blog is value your 24 hours. <laughs> All right, guys. <sighs> I feel good. I talked to you. I hope you feel good too. One more thing before I go, and this is the most important thing. I love you, man. <laughs> oh, I'm doing video.